All right, everybody, welcome back to Minecraft Hardcore. Since we last left off, I found a swamp. It was actually pretty close to home. I don't know how I didn't find it when I was flying around before. It's almost nighttime. I'm gonna hope that we get some slime spawns and then we'll be able to breed the frogs. Then I'm gonna have to wait to get the tadpoles because I need at least two of them. I wonder if I should try actually building a portal in the meantime, because like if we get lucky and it ends up in the right place, we might just be able to take one of these frogs through once we have a lead. And then that'll be one out of three uh, frog poos that we will need to get to complete the advancement. Speaking of advancements, I'll put our current progress up on the screen right now so you can see where we're at. And um, today, hopefully we'll get some more. All right. Fingers crossed, it'd be good if we just end up in like nether wastes. That way we can just hopefully have a magma cube right nearby and just don't actually jump in like early because that would be really annoying. Please just stay out of the portal for now, guys, because if it's not a nether waste, it's... I mean, is it actually, wait, it is, uh, it's Soul Sand Valley. Um, it's actually probably, this is our fortress that we've been in before, if I had to guess. Um, yeah, I don't know that we're getting any magma boys around here particularly easy. So I think I'm, I'm gonna break the portal in the overworld. We're gonna have to get three tadpoles then because I'm gonna have to take them to other places in order to bring them through, uh, which is a little annoying. All right, there we go. I hope none of them jump through. Hey, we still got one. <laughs> Tell me the other one. Okay, we still got two. It's a very small biome here, so I might have to go a little further away in order to get some slimes to spawn in. Is that a trident boy that I just spotted right there? Hey, sure. You know what? Another trident. Why not? Gimme. Surely. First try. First try. First try. First try. Please don't kill me, actually. That would be really unfortunate. Oh, no trident. What the heck? I can't believe I don't have two of them. Okay. Here we go. Slimes, slimes, slimes. Anybody? We might actually run into some boggies, dude because we are in the newest version. Ah, no slimes. There was uh, the first swamp that I came across just a little bit that way, and it had, <laughs> like, it was it was like 10 blocks <laughs> in, in size. I was like, oh, this is great. It's really gonna help. I'm gonna have to go ages and find another one, but fortunately this wasn't, it's, it's still not a very big swamp, but good Lord, there are no slimes anywhere to be found. This is my life. I can't breed the frogs without getting the slimes. I also need a lead to be able to take a hoglin through the portal. <sighs> I don't want to sleep because I want to be able to get the slimes. You know what? I didn't check on the way. Maybe we've got some powdered snow or some goats up here. One can hope, right? Like while we're unloading, maybe I can get lucky finding something. I like how the lower area is snowy and you get to the higher area and it's like, eh, we don't need that. <laughs> got any of that powdered snow anywhere? You got any of that powdered snow? It'd be pretty good. Hey, man. Nope. And <gasps> oh God. I'm like, I could I could certainly use a little bit more gunpowder, but not in the way that you just uh, completely avoid my, my hits. Yeah, no goats. This is not floating my goat. I'm going through so many fireworks. Oh yeah, there's my first swamp right there. Look at that. What a great swamp. And it's over. No slimes, but I am now poisoned from the bog. <laughs> so that's good. You know, I, I would have left you alone because I was thinking, hey, you're a new specimen here in the world, but no, not. Not with you poisoning me like that. It's not gonna happen. All right, somehow I'm gonna fail the second hit. Give me. There we go. Perfect. We're just uh, not getting slime spawns here, are we? In the meantime, I suppose we can just restock on some of the gunpowder that we've been using here. Oh God! No! Don't do it! Ah! I pre-fired on some of the guys so that we could just one-hit them. Oh frick! Well, I think I actually swapped around to my frick. Ooh. And then, who oh, got him? That's how you speed farm up some gunpowder. Another stack of fireworks, let's go. Okay, hey, you know what? Any slimes wanna spawn? This is actually just absurd. I don't know, should I cover this entire oceany area of the swamp in blocks or something just so I can, I can get them to exist? Or is this swamp just simply not meant to be? Oh, thank goodness we've actually got one. <laughs> I was thinking we we're gonna go like the entire night here and we're just not gonna get a single slime. This stupid swamp sucks. Like, come on, dude. Can't we get a larger one? Okay, you guys are not gonna ruin this for me right now, okay? You are not gonna ruin this for me. You're not gonna force me to not use my looting. God, leave me alone. Okay, I'm sorry about this, buddy, but uh, I really, I also really need to not accidentally hit the frog. This should actually be a good, good amount of Good amount of slime ball. Please, Mr. Frog, I'm begging you. I'm begging you. No! 
Don't do it! Don't... Don't... No! How could you? Oh, you little freaking god dang it. Here, here, come on, come here. I need you guys to make some babies. Pretty please. Come here. Hey, come on. Come on. Hippity hoppity, please. Why are you being so... F You're like on ice, dude. You're on... What is he doing? He's moonwalking. Oh my god. The bro, where are you going? There. And then... Make... Make baby. Do it. I mean, this also contributes to the breeding advancement, which is good. Um, okay, so now we'll be able to make leads. That'll be great. Okay, go. Do it. Go forth and procreate. Continue the species. Make the lineage happen. Only could load chunks, but the problem is, like, I'm gonna have to just chill here and wait for that. Don't you- Oh, you blow up! If you blow- Oh, balls! I sacrificed the looting because I am not having him blow up the eggs. I refuse to allow this to happen. Okay, do we wait or do we do we go home and come back? It takes 10 minutes. So actually, in the meantime, I need to hook each type of frog on a lead. So we should start off with you. Unfortunately, I don't have a lead and I don't think that I have any string inside of here, right? So we do need to take a trip, a uh, trip quick, a quick trip back home. Unless there's any spiders around here. Oh, by the way, oh, there's a beehive. I did track the location of a beehive, which actually is already full of honey. That's just right near home. So um, actually, where are we at? We're basically just like due north of home. I think it should be easy enough to come back here, just seeing if there's any spiders. Otherwise, we'll take a trip back. I'm going to get string. We'll make some leads. Uh, we'll hit up the beehive, maybe. And then we'll come back here and wait with the chunks loaded. Okay, so it's time for slime. How many should we do? Maybe like, eh, let's just do a few sets. And we'll have an even amount left over in case we need to breed more frogs. I hope that our current tadpole eggs will hatch into the maximum amount, which is five so that we can do at least three, at least three so we can take them elsewhere, grow them into the different kinds of frogs, and also choose places where we're gonna find magma cubes on the other side. Also though, in the meantime, okay, so wait, 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 wait. I have the campfire, I have the glass bottles. We do also need to get a total of five of the honey bottles because we need to make a, or we need to drink one. Oh, we got our boy over here. Okay, let's go. This is what I want to check. See if he had hatched. He has, which is huge. I put the thing in there, right? Part of me wants to see if I could have just fed him a regular seed, but I'm not going to. You know what? The advancement tracker shows a torch flower for feeding it to the little guy. So, well, sniffs. Mmm, munchy crunchy. I hope that was tasty. I hope you enjoyed it. I've been waiting to do that for a very long time. Uh, okay, so there we go. Beautiful. Now, let's hit up that beehive, which I believe is right over... Yeah, there it is. Okay, it's full of honey. So, I don't know if any bees are living in it. Bees at one point were obviously living in it, but I don't know if they still are, and I'm quite frankly too afraid to just, like, uh, hit it with a... You know, that's a good... You know what I should do, though, actually? I should hit this with the glass. No campfire, right? Although, wait, I can't remember. Do you have to have the campfire in order to get the... Yeah, you do. You do have to use the campfire in order to get be our guest, so I won't be able to tell exactly how many bees are inside it. Um but we'll have to check later or just find another hive that has like a ton of bees going around the outside and then we'll use that for uh, total bee location. However, I still need silk touch beforehand. So here we go. Be our guest. And now we have to wait for it to fill up again four more times. But I could actually, you know what? Here, glug, glug, glug. Need to do it for the uh, eating all foods advancement. So here we are. Hey, any, um, any other pigs around here? By the way, you just do a quick pig breeding, you know? Speaking of tackling the big advancements, no? Okay. Well, speaking of tackling the big advancements, all that we have left in the uh, hostile mobs advancement is the Zoglin. And now that we have a lead, we can try to lure one through a portal. Not really lure it, just kind of tug it viciously. <laughs> and then turn it into a Zoglin, and then that will be that advancement done. All right, quick trip into the nether. We'll see if we can use, rather than having to make another portal and then use some of the obsidian that we'll have to remine later, because not only do I have to make the portals for the frog, uh, frog lights in different biomes, but I also have to uh, frickin', um, I, gotta, I gotta get a lot more obsidian 
because of Uneasy Alliance. I know that there is a way to do Uneasy Alliance where you blow the TNT up like as you're going through the portal and then it gets the gas, the gas is still in the nether and then it like, you know, it solves the whole problem. You don't have to bring the gas through. However, I just don't feel competent enough to not only be dealing with gas fireballs, but also be dealing with uh, kabooms from TNT that I'm setting off myself. So, hey, follow me. Wait, 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 do we have any? I gotta get that, I gotta, okay, lure him over. Frick off, child, come here, come here. Come down, come down. You gonna, you gonna join me? Oh, you're mad too? Oh, this freaking guy, dude. Huh, wait, <laughs> did he come down and then that dude just hopped on? That's kind of funny. Uh, where is he? Where is he? Here he is, he doesn't see me right now. Okay, I need you to come down. I'm, don't make me spleef you, I'm gonna spleef you. There we go, okay. And then, come down, come down, come down. I know you're gonna get scared in a moment because of the portal and ow. And I'm gonna hook him, I'm gonna hook him. Oh, I'm gonna get yeeted into lava and that's not gonna be good, but come here, come through. Yes, we got him, we got him, we got him. Okay, I'm putting on the chest plate here for the other side. And then, he better not hop back into the portal immediately. I'm gonna be so annoyed. Where is he? Where's the, no, 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 no. Stay over there. You stay over there. Actually, he's scared of the portal, so it should be fine. Yes, he's gone and zogland himself. And this is the final mob that we need to do for victory. Yeah, monsters hunted, let's go. That is one of the big boys right there. Huge plays, we've been working on that for a long time. Now I would happily go over to the village right now. Uh, however, I don't think we have any spare villagers who don't already have a profession or weren't lost to the raid. Um, I could take this opportunity to just go get more obby. Since we're already here, just do a little bit of a mining expedition. Get the extra obby so that we can build a big box right up above our portal entry in the nether and um, get some gas spawns going inside that box of portals. I've done it this way before and it's a lot easier than trying to fishing rod them because good Lord, is that one of the worst things uh, ever to have to deal with. So here we go, mining time lapse. I don't know that this is entirely enough for our big box. Unless I do like one portal on one side and just close off the rest. I don't know. Anyway, I really miss having vein mine. But you know, in the meantime, actually, it would probably be kind of nice to just get some more pearls because we have to get to the roof of the nether anyway in order to do this. So let's utilize our newfound <laughs> umbrella that we've created here to just get some more pearls real quick. Cool. Cool, easy, easy. It's really nice when you can just get them all to come to one side instead of the umbrella that I built over there, which just, they run around all over the place and have a hard time taking them down. Eight ender pearls. All right. Surely that'll be good enough for us to be able to get through to the roof. Unless I'm trying to get through the wrong block, which is very, very possible. All right, before we go and just sit and wait for the tadpoles to hatch, let me see if there's any chance that I can get myself some silk touch. So I feel like our best bet is actually, let me go get one of the pickaxes in here. We'll just do some cycling. It's gonna show up on a level 30 or something and I'm gonna be just annoyed. But um, anyway, we don't, I'm just like making sure we don't already have a, I'm gonna grindstone you. And that'll be that. It's a shame we haven't already found a Silk Touch pickaxe in the end or something like that, but here we go. Don't accidentally juice one. Good one. What about Silk Touch, Silk Touch? Nope, 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 nope. Silk Touch here, Silk Touch here, Silk, 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 nope. All right, we cycle and eventually, definitely we will get Silk Touch. God, a fortune three. When you're not looking for it, come on, dude. I'm gonna be here until I've gone through all of my levels inevitably, you know? You know, to be fair, beehives, I think you can just break with anything. So I might as well try like different tools and maybe we will luck out and we will get silk touch on one of those other tools. And then I can, you, it's, it's not gonna show up, is it? <laughs> it's not gonna show up. Let's be real here, man. <laughs> All right, come on, show me the money. Show me the money somewhere. I totally forgot you can even get sharpness to show up in the enchantment table on an axe. I thought you had to put the book on directly for that. No. Frick, come on, come on, come on. It's my four, that'd be pretty cool if it wasn't that. <sighs> of course it shows up for level 30 on the ax. Like, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna cycle for this, right? I'm just I'm just gonna cycle. I'm just gonna cycle. I can't I can't I'm gonna have to get up to level 30. And do I really wanna bother with doing that whole thing? Or do I wanna just go to the village which I had to do anyway in order to get a cartographer villager and do all that? and then just also cycle for Silk Touch at the same time. I guess the question is, will it take longer to cycle or 
will take longer to get from 20 to 30? And the answer is, well, we don't know. It depends on RNG. I'm just gonna, let's just go to the village. Let's see how it goes. All right, we got lectern. We got cartography table. I know I said I was gonna wait for the tadpoles to hatch, but I'm just gonna go over. I don't remember the coordinates. There is a village over here. Knowing my luck, there's also a village right near the swamp, but I won't know that until after I do this first. But I like I vaguely remember that that one of the wait, wait, wait you know what? I no no need to stop for beehives. No need to stop for beehives until we actually have the silk touch. And then we can verify that it actually has three bees in it. Impeccable sense of direction. <laughs> I think that's the same one. Yeah, definitely. Wait, wait, wait. We haven't been in a uh, Driftstone Cave. So hold on. Another biome to add to the list. Uh, I may have added a couple when I was searching around for the swamp earlier. One of them obviously being the swamp. But here we go. Another one to add. And I think that probably, yep, Dripstone Caves. That counts. Good to go. Good to go. And now let's do a bit of a cycling. And as long as we don't um, do a raid on this place, we should be good. Okay, so I should just, hey man, um, I'm going to make you, one of you is going to be a cartographer. It's going to be you. You're always like, who, who's going to do the thing? No, don't, 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 don't go places. Don't go play. Hey, Mim, hold on. I got to, I got to we'll lock you in your house. <laughs> just, just, I need you to go, I need you to go back inside here, you know? Come on, come on in, come on in, come on in. Frick, please, please enter, enter, stop talking to the other dude. Stop talking to the other dude. Stop talking to the other dude. He's got nothing to offer. I, on the other hand, I have valuable things. I have valuable things. Oh my God, you freaking idiot. Oh, you steal the bed. Oh, this is freaked up. No, 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 no. Oh my God, he's he's trying to go to the other place. You know what? Here, I'm gonna do a trade with you. I'm gonna end up expending all of my emeralds here, man. I forget how much progress does this, not a lot of progress. I don't remember if there's a better trade that we can get at this level. Let me refresh my memory. There are most certainly not any different level one trades. So, um, pain, pain and suffering. You're gonna eat into all my emeralds. I hope you're happy about this. Let's find someone else to do some cycling and we'll get some silk touch. Okay, here we go. Is that the farthest away? It's gonna be you. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna, it's gonna be you. That makes sense. I, I figured I figured as much. Okay, silk touch. Amazing. Um, imagine it was the first one. Just imagine how cool that would have been if it ended up panning out. All right, we'll be with you in just a moment. There we go, silk touch for 11. Not the cheapest it could be, but quite frankly, it didn't take that long actually to do the cycling. And the rest of the emeralds I can now spend on buying maps because I didn't make a big enough sugarcane farm to just be able to trade paper and I need my paper for fireworks. I have not invested my resources wisely. So um, yeah, we're probably gonna wanna make another Fletcher or two over here as well. Oh God, uh, this is gonna take a while. This is gonna be a work in progress probably. Come on, come on, come on. <gasps> Next level, great, I have three emeralds left. Awesome, man, you've really taken me to the cleaners here. Oh God, you really did. Okay, glass panes, you know what? Easy enough to come by. I can make this happen. It'll take me a moment, but I can, wait, 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 wait. Okay, what do we need? What do we need? We need a black cat and we need a red. Yeah, that's not you, that's not you. Well, that's okay, let's make some glass. I can't be bothered to go and get coal. <laughs> so this is, this is my smelting method. Most efficient. I've made your lake deeper though, guys. You can now fish for treasure in there if you would like to do it. So, increasing the wealth of your village one trade at a time. Come to think of it, this may actually take more trades than I would like for it to do. We'll see. I didn't really math it out. I was like, surely the uh, conversion rate here will be pretty, okay, actually like pretty decent here. Just a couple more sets of that. And then we'll be good. What is this uh, Ocean Explorer? I think the next one actually might be Woodland or if it's the one after that, it's not master level though. So at least we don't have to worry about that. That might get us there actually, let's see. And then we will probably need more emeralds though, unfortunately. All right, there we go, next level. Are you Woodland Explorer? Are you Woodland Explorer? Come on, come on, come on. And yeah. Okay, 10 emeralds and compass. I have the emeralds. I have the iron. I don't have the redstone. Hey, um, don't go anywhere with with your, uh, don't go anywhere with your deals. I will, I will be right back. I promise. Actually, you know what? It's worth a quick little check here just in case this thing like actually goes down deep. Maybe we can find some 
it actually goes down pretty deep. Oh, God. Okay, there's got to be some down here. We're at Deep Slate. Uh, surely I didn't just fly myself into a pit that has nothing of value in it. Mm, that, that would be a thing. That, that's that's a thing that I would do, though. It's it's going to have... I, I'm going to find Diamond before Redstone, just because, you know, that's how it... Wait, 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 wait. We got it. I didn't find Diamond before Redstone. There we go. Thank you. Okay, compass. Great. I'm going to leave now and definitely not fly myself into a wall and die on the way out. I would never do that. I would never... Uh, oh, God. Eee! Ooh! Okay, wait, uh, okay, Woo. let's go, let's go, we'll, we'll block clutchage, and should I just, I'm gonna build out from here for safety, <laughs> before I, yeah, there we go, okay, there's a little bit of a, it was a rough angle there, uh, avoid the spikes, and Mr. Villager, inflation hasn't hit you, right, 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 we're good, we're good, we're on track, just forgot about that one little thing, I, I forgot that you need a map, and not, or, uh, you need a compass, and not a map, when it comes to, the trade because I never use this ever basically because in modded series we have structure compasses which are so useful and also somewhat cheaty but where did he go where did he go there he is hey come back here woodland explorer map Woo! all right this is huge I wonder how far away it is probably a good bit um all right glass might as well collect the rest and sleep it off and then we can head home I should have brought the anvil apply the silk touch and maybe find a beehive and hatch those eggs. Okay, wait, hold on. Definitely keeping this one in mind. Oh, there's two hive. Mmm. Which one is home to more of the bee population? Let me actually, you know what I should do? I'll just, if I grab some flowers and I just breed a few of these together, then we'll guarantee that there's at least three in one of the hives, right? So... Come here, come here. We've already done bee breeding, so this isn't contributing anymore towards the advancement, unfortunately. But there and there, baby. And then you guys are a little split up. I'm gonna need you to follow me, buddy. I'm gonna need you to follow me. If you and the other one do a little bit of bee breeding, then as long as we have six bees here, one of these hives is gonna have three, and then we can come back and we will be great. Okay, boom, boom. Heck yeah, heck yeah. Look at the little baby, I think. It's hard to tell, actually. <laughs> but now we have six. All right, we'll wait until nighttime or something like that. And um, this could be a total B location opportunity for us. Okay, before we go, let's get Silk Touch put on here. And then I'm bringing along some other stuff because while we're waiting for the eggs to hatch, we can uh, kill time by baking a couple of cakes. If there are any cows. I don't know if there are any cows, but we'll see. There are some cows. You know what? I'll at least get one of the cakes skewed up and ready to go here. Um, so we need another couple of buckets and boom, boom, boom. Thank you for your service. Actually, you know what? It's fine. I was thinking like, hey, we're waiting for the things to hatch. Let me just bake some cakes in the meantime. It's going to just be way easier to do it both right now. Uh, and there we go. Why am I baking cakes, you ask? Well, as it turns out, I need some cakes in order to do the alley, one of the two alley advancements. And since we have the Woodland Explorer map, I just want to make sure like I have everything on me that I'm going to need, which I don't. I need a note block as well, but we're going to take a pit stop back home before we go to the mansion. Where, should, where is it, by the way? So it is well off to the southwest, which is that way. Who knows how far? I figured while I'm waiting, I might as well check this area out that I spotted earlier and see if we have any drowned that happen to be carrying any Nautilus shells. And there are not Alyss shells around here. Um, this is like the one time I would actually hope for uh, wandering. <gasps> My man has it! Let's go! Actually huge. Wait, that would bring us to three, I think, which means I don't remember if if I have a wandering trader. Can they can they trade up to five? Can they get me the rest or not? Of course he's in the place where we <laughs> all the other dudes. Come on. I need that, bud. Thank you. Thank you. There we go. Very nice. Much appreciated. Giving it for the cause. Very cool. 
I just look at some emeralds because if I do run into a wandering trader, I'm not gonna have any money because I'm broke. Because the freaking dude took me to the took me to the cleaners. By the way, actually, I should grab some uh, grab some. I need shears for that, don't I? I was thinking like I gotta breed some turtles. But what I can do is I left my purple shulker behind. And if there was a, uh, if I did have any shares somewhere, they would have been in there. I'm gonna get some kelp though, so that uh, I can eat that at the very least. And um, hey, you know what? Another Nautilus shell is, there we go, gonna work for me. Don't think they've hatched yet, right? Cause it'd be a shame if I lost them. No, we're good. You know, it would have been smart is probably to bring another couple slime balls, uh, just so that like we could get more tadpoles if this isn't enough. I'm gonna yeah, just uh, yeah, real quick. It's not too far away. One moment. All right, let's pop those in. We could eat one or just throw it in the uh, chest where we're putting all the food. And then we got another. I don't think that's the first mending fishing rod though. Actually, maybe it is. Saves us a book once again. We got the shears. We have the extra buckets for the tadpoles. We have two emeralds to our name. Oh, good. And we're gonna bring some of these. And then I also like, I spotted a bunch of animals on the way. So um, yeah, throw that in there. Good to go. We'll eat it later. Bring this along. And we'll be able to breed up a few as well. I think like pigs, llamas, maybe some chickens. The llamas are the only one that might not be the easiest to find, so that's good at least. All right, you know, not the most compelling of advancements to do, but but let's, let, let's, we'll breed a couple horses, which is very tedious, because we have to tame them first, and then don't mind the fact that I have slightly less carrots in my inventory right now, and that I definitely tried to breed them prior to taming them and forgot all that whole thing, but I don't, I don't, I don't work with horses super often. <laughs> Okay, and then you, and then, oh God. Then we have to find the donkey as well, and we gotta breed the horse and the donkey and get the mule, and then we have to do it again, and then we have to breed the donkey. It's such a tedious one, right? Oh, frick, I didn't mean to do that. Um, You gotta do horse, horse, which is fine. Donkey, donkey, which is fine, but then you have to do mule, mule, which is not fine. There, there, okay. And this doesn't help us, because it's just horse, horse right here. Um, And then, this is okay though, because we grab our carrots and we do a couple of biggies, easy peasy, boom, boom. All right, and then I'll get the hay bales out because I know there's also some uh, llamas on the way. Maybe we'll get the seeds out as well. And it was just over this hill, we had a couple llamas. And yeah, somehow I haven't done chickens until this point, but come on. There we go, good job guys, you're doing great, procreating, making the species go forward, and now we get uh, the hay bales. All right guys, here we go, let's, uh, you are the lucky couple. Boom, you have to be tamed, you have to be tamed. It's one of those moments. You guys got a free lunch. I dislike this tremendously. Well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna at least tame them, and then we'll be back, and then we'll be back, and then we're definitely gonna remember which of the plethora of white llamas are the ones that I had tamed. You stay there. Just stay there really quick for me, buddy. Okay, just if you don't mind, stay there real quick and don't move. Okay, you're there and then it was also you. I just want to not have to deal with this again, even though it's just kind of silly, but all right. Now we'll know which ones to breed together. And then we come back over here <laughs> and uh, we do a little bit more frog breeding and it'll be good. I actually see a beehive just right there. So, hey, you know what? Maybe we can get lucky. Wait, no frog spawn yet. Um, where's the other man's? Hey, Mr. Hoverboard Man. Uh, which, one, which one of you is uh, the hoverboarder who is just sliding all, the, all over the place? Hey, hey, come here. I just don't want to cooperate. I do just love the way they walk. It's just so funny. <laughs> okay, here we go. Right next to the other ones. That would be really convenient. You know, that'd be pretty cool. Go do it. I'm gonna give you a little, little extra nudge, a little extra nudge, and they're eh, close enough. Let me check that hive really quick. See if um, there's any way to tell if, where was it over here? If there's any way to tell if there's three bees in there, it would make life a little easier. And then what, what we should do is we should just, any of the hives that we can find, just take them closer to home and then I'll be able to get the honey quicker for the, for the block. Where were you? There they are, my babies. No, come back, come back, come back. I need you to come here, yep. And then we also get a freebie advancement and we did get, how many did we get? Dude, we should get five of them? No, come here. Um, Honestly, yeah, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna collect them all because if we have a mess up or something like that, then it'll be good to have uh, more rather than less. So I'm sorry, I'm, uh, I'm, don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like that. You have no attachment, okay? You were, you weren't gonna do anything here. 
Don't pretend it was going to be otherwise. Yo, Max, Max, though, is actually sick. And last one, last one. And boom. It's just like when I was a little kid and I collected some tadpoles and I was like, this will be so cool. I'm going to grow them at home and then I grew them at home. And then there were a few frogs that escaped the terrarium and were jumping around the room. We managed to recover them, but I was like, oh, God, I've made a terrible mistake. And my mom was not happy about the whole thing, unsurprisingly. <laughs> Um, hey, while we're here, though, let me get those seagrasses. It's another uh, breeding opportunity for the turtles. Two should be enough. And then I'm going to have to come back here for the llamas at some point. Freaking, freaking eating lunch for free. You know, honestly, I'm just like, why don't we try any beehive that we come across and, um, and, and just see if it works, right? Maybe there's three bees in there. You never know. Any bees? Nope. Rip. Uh, but we could bring it closer to home, and then maybe it will happen. We'll put it there. I'll need to get some flowers. Um, and then we'll bring the others. Hopefully one of the ones we found in that plane are good to go. Uh, so the next step that we have to do with the frogs, basically, is um, we gotta we gotta take them to other biomes. And I don't know if it's better to look through the nether, and then go through the nether and see if the corresponding in the biome in the overworld is good, or we just fly through the overworld and hope that eventually when we go into the nether in that area, it's a place where we get magma cubes. I'm not sure, but you know what? In the meantime, I think let's do Woodland Explorer. Let's find the mansion. We do need a note block, and I think that the two cakes and the note block should be the only things that we need as far as the alley advancements go. And if we're lucky, then maybe we'll find some mountains on the way, a goat, some powdered snow, a handful of animals to breed. Um, but, uh, all right. Hopefully I don't die of kinetic energy as soon as I've <laughs> gone and removed the frickin' uh, totem from my offhand. Wouldn't that be fun? Wait, oh god, I should... Yeah, I've got iron, it's fine. I was gonna say I should have a bucket, but we have iron. Uh, I'm hoping I haven't left anything behind, because that would be quite bad. But here we go. Oh, is that powder? That's gotta be powdered snow right there. That's a mound of powdered snow. Let's go. And it looks like this could be a place to find some goats to float. Fingies crossed. Here we go. Let's do it. Light as a rabbit. Come on, here we go. And there we are. Beautiful. Oh God. I feel like there's gotta be a goat somewhere up at the top here, right? 100%. This looks like, uh... okay, it didn't go as far up as I was thinking it might. <laughs> Maybe no lofty beaks here, but um, just just some stiff peaks and, you know, like we're baking meringue or something like that. I'm, oh, wait, 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 wait. There might be some goats. There may be some goats around here. Come on. I know you're around here. Don't hide from me. I just want to put you in a boat. It's like one of the few absolutely completely harm. Wait, 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 wait. Is that, is that? Yes, we got a goat. Let's go. Please don't knock me off and destroy me. I just want to put you in a boat. It's like. Pretty, pretty chill. Don't, don't, don't ruin my life, please. Go, go, go. No, I didn't mean it. Yeah, we got goat floating. Dude, we're popping off. All right, and I will even like free you with it completely harmlessly. See, that was completely painless. I'm even gonna sleep in here. You wouldn't, you wouldn't run into me and destroy me while I'm sleeping now, would you? No, of course you wouldn't. What a nice guy. What a nice cooperative fellow this guy was. Awesome stuff. Okay. See, sometimes it's nice to just go and explore because you can find some miscellaneous stuff on the way that you've been waiting to do. Like maybe we even run into like mushroom islands along the way. That would be, that'd be a big place. Wait, 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 wait. I think, I think we got a red. I think we've got a red. Wait, where's the, uh, and also, like, I've been neglecting the whole just breeding a couple of cats together. So if we do find a village that has a couple of cats in it, we should uh, do that. Come here, come here. I'm pretty sure it's a red and not a tabby. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Right over here. I swear, if you jump off a cliff, <laughs> I'm going to be upset. Don't you dare. Where are you? There he is. There he is. Look, that's a red, right? A red, black cat, black cat is all I need after this. Come to me. No, don't do it. Oh God, it's so, oh, it's scary up here. Come here, right, right, right. No, this is the story of my life. I'm gonna, do I do it by force? <sighs> don't do it. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, he's right next to the, oh, you're scaring me, buddy. Right here. No, stop panicking. Stop panicking. We're cool. Yeah, yeah. No, you went the wrong way and you made me. He, like, I, I turn, I'm like, I have to click on you somehow. I have to click on you somehow, but you're not lined up with me. Please, 
Please, you're gonna be scared. As soon as I turn, you're gonna be scared. Wish you would sit back on the ledge, my friend. Yeah, that's a red. Hold on, wait for it. That's a red. Okay, okay. Oh, imagine there's a black cat here. Hold on, hold. I, I'm gonna let you follow me around because just in case we do find another cat here, even if it's not a black cat, we can get some breeding in and that'll be cool. Oh, you know, I also do need, I need a rabbit. Frick, 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 frick. I'm sorry. I do need this for rabbit stew. Hey buddy. All right, there's some risky area to have you like following me around, but we're just checking. We do have another cat. Oh, we have a couple cats here. Okay. One of you is gonna, yeah, yeah, you're seeing it. You're seeing, yeah, we're, you're seeing what I'm seeing. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, and <gasps> bada bing, bada boom. All right, where's my other mans? Where's my red man? Somewhere around here, and then we'll get some cat breeding in. Okay, you know what? Actually, if I just go a little further away, they'll both teleport to me, right? Right, right? No, I don't think there's a black cat over there. Why are they not following? Where's the other one? I swear if he's gone off a cliff, dude. I can't. I can't. I don't know where he is. He literally, literally just showed up. Hey, 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 no, what are you, where, where, why are you running from me? What are you doing? You need to breed, come here. Where, I don't know what he's doing. Yo, come here. We are friend. I need you to breed. Why are you, you guys, you guys are freaking with me right now. Okay, come here, come here, come here, come on. I'm up. Let's make some babies here. Okay. Here we go. Here we. Yes, that's more like it. Well done. Well done, guys. Now all we have left is a black cat, and then everything kitty cat related is done. I'm gonna sit you guys here, and then we just keep on keeping on. You don't by any chance happen to have three bees in there, do you? Oh, let's go. <laughs> hey. Eventually it was gonna work, right? You'll love to see it. All right, we'll bring that one home. And then um, I actually have run into a couple other villages. Unfortunately, no black cats, but we, uh, we still keep cruising. Not seeing any progress on the map, but hopefully soon. Uh, we just became a bigger dot on the map. We're getting closer. We are now centered in east-west. Getting closer, getting closer. Oh, what do you know? A real big, an actual like, Big biome swamp, how nice. And it's rainy. Oh, oh, we're almost there, let's go. I'm sleeping it out and it's no longer raining. Oh, it's raining, okay. Don't kaboom, don't kaboom. I saw a creeper right there. Don't do it, don't do it, don't do it, don't, 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 don't. Okay, everything's safe. No problems here. Everything is good. Actually, you know, in the whole scheme of things, I have no water bucket. Um, In the whole scheme of things, not too far away. Like. Pretty decent. Hey, there it is. Love to see it. Back on here, and yeah, we're gonna we're gonna go in with full armor equipped, you know? There's the entrance. I always forget which side the entrance is on. Could just break a window, but it always feels nicer to go through the front door. And then you just go burn the whole thing down afterwards. I'm not gonna do that this time, you know? Maybe maybe in this case, I will enter and exit with grace after finding the front door buried. All right, well, here we go. Um, should I put, I don't know, should I put the shield in or should I just, uh, oh, there are a lot of skeletons in here. Maybe we should light it up. It's okay, they can fight each other. And we just need to find some alleys really at the end of the day. Also though, I suppose, you know, if we can find the diamond blocks, we haven't really been doing much with that lately in terms of crafting anything with diamonds, but we'll see any jail areas and we need to get the Vex armor trim also. Can't forget that. It does have a 50% chance of spawning in Woodland Mansion chests though, so fingers crossed we're not gonna be like ultra unlucky. Vex, Vex. I don't remember uh, what specific chest qualifies as a Woodland Mansion chest though. So I can't remember if any of these ever have any any items in them or if they're all entirely empty. Hey, man. Frick, man, we could get along. We could get along. All I'm looking for is an armor trim and for your prisoners. Okay, no, whenever I see cobblestone, I'm like, is that it? Is that it? Nope, not it. And no, used to having Bane of Villagers in a <laughs> different series so I can just like one hit the villagers. Doesn't quite work that way here. Anyway, all right, surely there is a jail somewhere here on the first floor, right? Right, right? Don't blow the place up. No, no, don't do that. There we go, thank you for the gunpowder, much appreciate. There we go, alleys, alleys, alleys. 
Hello? No, but nobody's in here. It's the worst jail. Like, can you imagine if I get all the way here and I don't find an alley? That would be truly ridiculous. Oh, please, not like this, though. Okay, handful of zombies. Could have brought the smite sword. Don't steal the emeralds, this guy. Just immediate thievery. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I actually don't know what I'm gonna do if there is not a jail in here that has alleys in it. I'm I'm gonna be I'm gonna be ruined. I'm gonna be ruined. Vex? Yes, we got the Vex armor room. Let's go. That is huge. I should have also probably uh, taken a look in the other room that was like this, uh, because maybe there could have been some good stuff. But anyway. Oh man. Dude, please, please. Jail. I've never wanted for there to be a jail more. Oh, this is not good. You can't be serious. Jail is a first floor only structure, isn't it? I don't think you can find it on the second floor. Oh, no way this is happening. I found the most puny single cell jail room. You're gonna force me to go hunting for pillager outposts. Seriously, you're gonna do this to me? Dang it, man. Figured we'd hit this one up before we get to the uh, top floor. Good amount more gunpowder, multi-shot. Guess I can take that. Okay, uh, I'm so bummed here, man. I'm so bummed about this whole thing. Uh, it was too good to be true, wasn't it? Like it was a fairly close mansion. So it's like, there's no way. We're gonna actually find what we need here in the form of alleys. I mean, we I guess we got the armor trim. Yeah, oh God. We got the armor trim, which is good, but uh, as far as other stuff, not so much, not so much. Good Lord, I need you guys to chill. Holy frick, give me a moment. Whew. I don't wanna have to pop a god apple here, but I guess if we have to, we have to. We're not gonna find a jail up here, I don't think, right? Oh God, double, double trouble once again. Careful, careful. You should have a tendency to yoink the valuables. When, as soon as they fall on the floor, nothing, nothing, nothing. No jails, no jails. 99% sure it is already a lost cause here, but we're just, we're checking, we're checking. No, that, stop, oh God, I don't need to deal with that. I don't need to, de I don't need it, I don't need it, I don't need it. You guys should consider um, putting a jail on this floor, you know, and designing the stuff. If I had to give you some feedback, you should consider it. You know, it's basically ground floor. You have a multi, multi-level terrain around this place. You might as well be accommodating to it in your design, right? <sighs> Okay, here we go, Mr. Evoker. Stop. And done. I was like, did I not get a totem? Oh, there's another one. Shouldn't be surprised. Just disappointed that it's not an ally. This is so sad. This is so sad. Ooh, get juke, buddy. Get juke. Oh, of course he gets the vexes off. Leave me alone. You've all I'm already suffering enough here, okay? You don't need to just add insult to injury by simply existing. Freaking rubbing it in with evil alleys all over the place in here, but no no nice alleys that we actually need and want. Just terrible. Imagine this. Give me a diamond block, at least. Ease my suffering, why don't you? Why are we missing a block there? Mind the gap. All right, hello? Anything interesting, anything compelling up here? Go away! Oh, oh okay, hold on. <sighs> Yikes, one second, one moment. Holy frick, that's a little a little dicey. Okay, I'm gonna need a gapple. I'm gonna need a gapple. Oh, of course, there's a creeper right there, too. Yikes. Okay. Holy frick, can you guys stop? We don't have, there are no more, your your guy is gone. He's not here anymore. He's, he's dead. Please, how many hits can you possibly take? These guys are like souped up health. I hate it, I hate them, I hate them. You're still alive? You cannot be still alive. You guys have more health than like a skeleton or something, or I just keep hitting different ones every single time. You're done. Ugh. A mean, oh my God, they're all just waiting. Okay, okay. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. It just, nobody wants me to have any success. Nobody wants me to have anything good around here. Jeez. Okay, at least we're getting a few emeralds, which, you know, maybe we're gonna have to fly really, 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 really far away and find another village. Oh my God. And then get another Woodland Explorer map. And then after spending all of the emeralds once again, then it'll point us to this mansion. <laughs> Oh God, miss me, miss me, miss me. Okay, do we have a do we have a diamond thing anywhere in here? Hello, hello. Any hidden diamond room? Hidden diamond room? Hidden diamond room? Maybe somewhere? Oh, wrong place for it. Usually it'd be behind that guy, right? I think generally, potentially, 
but it's not, no, it's not looking good. I don't think the hidden diamond room is uh, happening in here, sadly. Man, this sucks. I don't know if I've gone to a woodland mansion since alleys were added to the game and had them not be there. A freaking empty jail cell, they already escaped or something. They knew I was coming, they're like, this guy, not again, we gotta get out of here. Oh, God, I thought I had my lights on. Everything's good, everything is fine. Well, I don't think I missed him. I think we're just fricked. We're gonna have to just run into pillager outposts and hope eventually that we find one. But I mean, this is not great because it, uh, Woodland Mansions are like the most reliable way to find them. And it has struck out here. Unbelievable. At least we've done well on advancements today. We, we did a decent amount, but. Oh, what a bummer, dude. What a bummer. I guess um, we gotta, we gotta trek back home empty handed and no alleys for us. So it's a good place for us to wind down today though. Hopefully we'll find some at some point in the future. I mean, we have to, or die trying. Make sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel for more, check the playlist to catch any episodes in the series you might've missed. Stay tuned for more and I'll see you in the next one.